So guys, today we're gonna look at Sword Arts Online Color Realization. This is the third series of the Sword Arts Online. The first series is uh, Hollow Fragment, followed by Lost Song. This video game developed by Akuria and published by Namco, Bandai Namco Entertainment for PS4 and PS Vista. It was released in October 2016, and in the uh, later months, it released for North American, European territories, and all other Asian country. The protagonist here is a Kirito, but uh, the funny thing is you can change between the male character and the female character, but the voice is still male character Kirito. So I'm choosing the the female character. Here you can see the equipments and the skill tree. I just uh, downloaded the add-on, which is the first add-on is uh, Abyss of Shrine Maiden. Chapter one is Explorer of illusory miss in this uh, chapter actually we can explore uh, Vulcanus Citadel and the caps race to 100 and also the rank skill uh, we can achieve the high rank skill with Asuna, Silica, Respect and Premier this can completed by uh, this can be achieved by completing new heroine quests and the second chapter is Channel of Casuality, Causality, which uh, at the Kisumel and Argos Ghost Living event. And here you can fuse and also Astra are also available. The other add on you don't want to miss is a uh, lot of Inferno Red Boss. So after you clear an area, you can uh, challenge again the boss and get the loot from that one and the other add-on is missing chest which is you can exchange gold pieces for items and also they give us the enhancement which is weapon armor weapon and protective gear and if of weapon so we can uh, enhance weapon from level 7 to level 9 This is the menu that you can see here. This is the map. In the menu, you can have the equipments and also the skill and also the maps. And this is the quest list. Actually, there are a lot of quests. I can have around 200, 400, and still not getting done all of that one. So basically, don't worry. You will get coal enough to enhance and transform your weapons and equipment. And I also suggest that you buy the season pass, which include all the LC. It is worth it actually. The main game itself is the Warriors of the Sky. After you complete the Warrior of the Sky. You can go to the Explorer of Illusory and also the Tunnel of Causality. The subquest is too many, but then uh, you should choose. My suggestion is just choose the higher level. The descent vantage of actually i accidentally just go from level 20 23 and goes directly instantly to level 80 which is the advantage is i can get uh, enough skill to max my skill which is i can choose sword and everything and also uh, I can have uh, more items 
like in the accessory shop, the weapon shop, the armor shop. So, uh, but these items, this weapon actually is not worth it with the one that we get from the add-on or uh, we get from the enhancement. There is also uh, an area. This is the town. There is a market street area. There is a teleport stage uh, where you can teleport to the maps directly to do the quest. And also the scene, overlook scene. Basically, nothing rare item here. Weapon also, see, all is going down. Not gonna give you boost or anything here. But just wondering sometimes is if you enhance this one, it might be uh, higher than what you have in the weapon right now. This is the shady merson, so you can have uh, some rare items. And this one is new, so you can transform your material. There are the true power is actually giving you boost on the weapons, but yes, needed to level uh, nine plus. And then you can have also the single legendary weapon. You can have the sword, blade, scimitar, rapier, club, katana, two hand, axe. Depends on what you are going to play, what your play style. I myself choose the swords. And if you look at the skill, it's really too many. Too many skills that you can have. This is how this is the path of the legendary items where and trans transformation where you can have uh, and this guy actually give you the clue where you get the material. Basically, just kill the nightmare. You can see the NM NM nightmare uh, monsters. I would say. They will give you the rare material, and you can also change your look here. But you have to pay twenty, sorry, two thousand coal, I guess. So you can change your hat, your hat look, the armor look, and also the greaves. And you can deactivate this uh, visualization in your menu so when you click the option you can have that uh, visualization off well if you like cute uh, character it's very very satisfying to change uh, this uh, visualization. Now this is the blacksmith. You can enhance and you can transform here, but you really need to have all the material, which is the material itself is not is not very rare, except for the legendary items. But don't worry, you still need to get it to level nine plus. Until you can transform it, transform it to legendary items. This is the event list. You can see where in the map, or you can look like this one, like what I do. I can just look around here and see if there is this kind of uh, star quest. And basically. This game has many texts which uh, I don't want to spend my time 
looking at it one by one uh, with what and everything oh no I just skip so most of them I skip uh, except uh, sometimes there is a bad bad scene I mean uh, the character there taking a bath <laughs> this is the red boss which I said that after you clear out the area you can challenge again the boss in the area it will give you items and loots and you can have 16 characters level a uh, characters party which you can uh, choose how you want to proceed with the fighting you can have two level uh, two two parties going on different uh, team or full red party or three things party the other advantage if you get level 80 actually you can success in no time this is what ah level 14 at this moment i can only clear three maps we'll go again in another maps and we'll clear it in uh, and don't forget to check on your trophies because this trophies actually is taking a lot of time like you have to increase the affinity or uh, the friendship with uh, your other characters your other friends your other party team so you can have the trophy just check on the trophy if you like achievement The other advantage to get level 80 Basically you don't have a To do all the things Or be stressed about the Your level that you are unable to kill The monster so depends on how you want to enjoy this game you want the ACS uh, part or you want challenge but this game give you many challenges even if you are at level 80 some boss I believe that uh, surrounding an area cannot be defeated even uh, at my level I will put it on another video if I already kill this boss but this is the summary of uh, Sword Sword Online Hollow Realization which is uh, I just bought at you know 2007 uh, 2017 I mean <laughs> sorry guys it's a uh, morning here this is the last red uh, that I want to show you it's pretty much easier to go on this kind of raids but it surely takes time this game is takes time that you have to play hours and hours and after you clear clear out various of sky you can also uh, get it directly to the Abyss of Shrine Maiden Chapter 1 which is Explorer of Illusory Mist and basically if you have add-on uh, for the Chapter 2 the Channel of Casuality be careful in the beginning uh, when you open up the game you will be asked if you want to just go uh, and play the Channel of Casuality 
just be careful to click because if not then you will miss all the games all the story here which is very good the story and also there you, you will engage with some spoiler there uh, the girl is very sexy and cute you will see in the in the end of these videos some of the which I capture see this one okay I guess that's it from me see you on another review